Hey everybody, welcome back to Cataclysm, the beta. <laughs> and we hope that, like all betas, some things will change over time. Like whatever's going on with this quest. So let's just uh, take the quest and maybe, yeah, we're, we're phased into another phase now. We don't have to listen to the overlapping dialogue. Alright. What? Not sure exactly what was going on there. I think there was a conversation between two NPCs, but for every player that started the quest, the NPC started the dialogue lines again, and they just ended up endlessly overlapping. Uh, now we're phased into a different, different phase. So yeah, welcome back, guys. Thank you for being here. I appreciate it. Let's see. Among humans again. So Credence Potion did not kill you. Well, I suppose that means the human inside of you isn't controlled then. I guess I won't be shooting you after all, at least not yet. Go speak to Krennin Arnis and give him the good news. He's in charge of the house where we keep your kind. Just remember, I've got my eye on you. You so much as try anything funny and you'll get a bullet between the eyes. Alright. Uh, somewhere over here is also the class trainer. Ah, uh, that was an earthquake. That must have been the Cataclysm earthquake. Well met. Ah, we live another day. Ah, yes, the effects of the curse cannot ever be fully cured as far as we know. With treatment, however, your mind will remain yours and not that of a wild animal. We are fortunate that the treatment worked on you. Normally, I can only treat recent infections. We'll need to continue your medication if we're to have you reverse the curse. I will need Mandrake Essence to brew another batch of my serum for you. You will find a crate stashed beneath the shed southwest of town. So we are leaving the town. Uh, I was kind of hoping that they would put a... What can I do for you? A hunter trainer here. Uh, we have professions. They have all of these kind of coalesced into one guy now. So we can learn anything we want from him. We're going to do skinning and leatherworking. There we go. That's enough gabbin for me today. All right. Watch your back. Uh, we need a skinning knife. Get gabbin, get He's going. not a vendor, so... I have what you see. We have a banker here, but we don't I have a class trainer business. or a trade goods vendor. Uh, is there anybody upstairs, perchance? Absolutely not. Pretty cool design. I really like the architecture of the Gilnean houses. We do have some trainers maybe around town here. I wish we could just track that. Let's do repairs. It does say it's tracking our class trainer. They must be outside somewhere. Yeah, they're right back here. More earthquakes. I got a bad feeling. Nothing new Keep yet. Your chin up, eh? Don't we have some kind of like Worgen racial ability to sprint? Activate your true form, increasing current movement speed. Yep. That is on a two minute cooldown though. The crate has been smashed and the vials inside it appear to have been broken. Well, that's not good for us. We've got some Forsaken here. Looks like they're coming off a couple of ships on the coast. We are going to have to deal with that. This guy looks mighty dead. A long knife with a skull ornament on it sticks out of the mil militiaman's ribs. As you look around for clues, you spot a pair of savage looking warships on the shore. Gilneas is being invaded. Bring word back to Duskhaven's mayor. Alright, we could do that.
Ain't you a chipper looking one? That's enough gabbing for me today. The reefs have always protected us from the coastal attacks. The earthquakes must have opened a passage for the forsaken ships. Quick, slow down the attackers while I get the rest of the militia ready. I think I can hear the prince and some of the men engaging the forsaken even as we speak. Speak to Liam and see how you can be of use. Watch your back. Oh my people. Oh Gilneas. You're alive. I thought I was having dreams about the old days when I heard your voice. For my people. For Gilneas. I'm still not sure if you're alive or dead, human or worgen. I'm not even sure I'm really awake, but this I am sure of. We're going to kill a great many of these motherless forsaken. For my people. For Gilneas. Look here. The big fat ones, abominations they're called, they don't go down easy, so don't tackle them on your own. But I have an idea so crazy, it just might work. Or it might get you killed, if we're not careful, I suppose. There's a barrels of gunpowder beneath the sheds and, my, and by the windmills. Grab them and toss them right on the Abomination's heads. I'll take care of the rest with this trusty old blunderbuss. Yes, sharpshooting with a blunderbuss. That works really well. We don't have any quest tracking for this. So maybe we'll come across them as we're out. Yeah, it looks like they're out here. been a very long time since I've done any questing here and like whatever questing I did back in the day was probably pretty limited. I don't think I ran a character through here more than maybe once or twice.
For my people, for Gilneas. For my people, for Gilneas. For my people. We could take it from here. Check in with Mayor Armstead. There are only a small part of the Forsaken forces. If we don't move quickly, we're going to have bigger problems on our hands. See what you can do to engage the Forsaken army at their landing location. for you keep your chin up eh lord godfrey is leading the attack near the forsaken landings area see what you can do to help us keep the forsaken back i've been told godfrey has commandeered the storm cellar in the a alan farmstead far to the west seek him there good day Unleash the beast, I'm not going to lie. I don't like the idea of having Worgen among our ranks. Who knows how long till Krennin's concoction wears off and you're trying to chomp one of our heads off. Until that time, however, we can make ample use of your ferocity. I want you to go out in the battle and kill as many of those Forsaken as you can, in as brutal a way as you can. Speak. Oh, okay. What now? The Forsaken Catapults are kicking the snot out of us, and even if we do take care of them, they've They've got two ships with rows of cannons at the ready. I have a plan to kill two birds with one stone. You're the stone in this plan. Take out the machinist manning the catapults. After this, use the catapults to launch yourself aboard the Forsaken ship. If your aim isn't terrible, we should be able to land safety. Yeah, I'm sure that's definitely the way to board a ship. Any friend of Greymane is a friend of mine. Save the children. The military will not allow me outside the cellar, but my children are still in my farm. Please, you must go find them. The Forsaken have no regard for innocent life. My kids are in great danger. Farewell. I'm sure they're fine. I'm not really sure what to make of the floating traps here. That's uh, a little bit weird. I don't think they're supposed to be moving. I think they're supposed to just be like hung up on the wall. I am not sure where these kids are at. Um, without any questing on the mini-map, it's kind of hard to see. It says that they're right here somewhere, so maybe they're they're either underground or they're up top where we were at. Uh, here's a kid. Oh, there we go. Uh, that's one of them rescued. 
I guess they're all kind of in the same area. Hey, at least that's how I kind of read the mini-map. Yeah, there is one up here. Or, or there was, like another player clicked on them and now they've run away. I don't know if I'm supposed to wait for them to respawn or exactly... Yeah, we gotta wait for them to respawn. Okay, uh, that's two down. And then the other one looks like they're not in the same building. Alright, with that done, we can focus on killing the Forsaken, and then we gotta find a cannon to shoot us onto the ships. Well, that worked okay. Well, if not for the dead zone, we would have had that one. Looks like our buddy here was kind enough to invite us to a group. I appreciate that. And it looks like the other captain is going to be over on the other ship, which makes sense. I'll tell you what, for one reason or another, our pet has been basically completely useless. Well, for whatever reason, maybe it was thanks to the error message, we didn't get him. Uh, which really sucks.
And yeah, apparently we're, we maybe we won't get this one either. Yeah, that's not not quite. They just need to they just need to enable mob sharing. I feel like maybe even if it wasn't like a permanent part of the game, especially for like betas, maybe even for like opening nights, like when everything's really busy, it's really hard to tag enemies. Just go ahead and turn on mob sharing, so we don't have to do this kind of stuff. I literally have a line behind me. Like, no one's grouping up. I wonder if that's because of, like, the Lua errors were not able to get into groups in time to share credit. Because, like, literally no one's grouping up. There's just a line of people. So weird. I wonder where the Hearthstone is set. Trade District. Uh, that seems like Stormwind. I got a bad feeling. Long live Greymane. What now? Uh, can we even equip melee weapons? Yeah, of course, we got a staff. I don't think we need the dagger, but I'll take it. Maybe we'll sell it. What now? Uh, and we'll grab the gloves. Speak. What now? Excellent work so far. Our scouts have identified the leader of the Forsaken Ground Assault. One of Sylvanas' hand-picked Dark Rangers is overseeing the battlefront from the Walden House near the shore. Take this whistle and use it when you're close to her. I'll have my men let loose our attack mastiffs to take her down. Be careful, you don't want to engage her alone. It's a dark ranger. Fine, Gilnair merchandise here.
What now? Speak. What now? As the land shatters, what in the world was that? Those were not cannons or catapults, that's for sure. Go outside and see what is going on. I wonder how that's going to make any sense. You know, like, they said that we're going to get Worgen in the pre-patch for Cataclysm. Like, are they going to change the entire old world in the pre-patch? Because how could they how could they give us goblins and worgen in the pre-patch if that's not when the cataclysm actually happens? I'm pretty sure that's how it's gonna have to be. I'm pretty sure that the world is gonna have to be changed not when Cata actually launches, but when the pre-patch goes live, when we get worgens and goblins. Otherwise it wouldn't make sense. Oh god, what's happening out here? <laughs> I guess they capsized. It looks strangely like they're floating in the sky. Although a lot of things are floating, so yeah, maybe maybe we're floating. Maybe there's supposed to be water here. Yeah, I, I think like something weird is going on. I don't know what's happening here actually. I don't know if this is a bug or what. For my people. Uh let's see. For the ocean, it swallowed everything. The land, the forsaken, our men. For my people. I was on my way when it happened. No time to waste, a good half of the town watch was in that area when it collapsed. Get in there and save as many as you can. Yeah, I think it's supposed to be, uh, like this is water. Um, I, I don't know how we're supposed to navigate this exactly. Um, I guess that's like the risk of playing in a beta. Is that you're, you're, you're testing things. Alright, we made the jump. Uh, I can't seem to interact with them in any way that actually picks them up. That's a problem. I wonder if, like, there's no way that reloading fixes this, right? Yeah, I didn't think so. Oh, we can get them. We just then have to figure out how how would we then get out of here this area is not like conducive to climbing like there's no way to climb you know there's no way to climb and there's also no way to swim okay that's that might be one of the only ways in and out of here actually like that little thing we just found that might be the- oh god, we can't fall off of here. I don't know if we ever come out again. Now I can't get around these. Oh, there we go. Okay, so that's it. That's what we have to do. There's a little pathway here. Uh, again, there, there should be water here. There's just not because- oh no, oh no, we might be shit out of luck. Oh guys, I think we're done. I don't think we get out of here. Yeah, I think we're- I think we're done. <laughs> I don't know what happens now. We delete the character and we go again. Uh, we are not. We we couldn't afford to fall in this. Like this was not the place to fall. There's there's no way out. Oh my God! Where is this gonna take me? I don't even know how to get to Gilneas from Stormwind. To be honest, I have no clue. I don't even know if it's possible. The fate of Gilneas has not been decided. You cannot escape. Ugh. Isn't- there's no command for getting stuck? Worken bugged out and can't use Hearthstone. Yeah, during the quest, gasping for breath, you're supposed to save people, except there's no ocean. The help section is unavailable in the beta, so we can't do the unstuck option. So, this just might be irrevocably broken, guys. That might be what's happening here. There, There is no unstuck.
Yeah, there's no way to get unstuck. Uh, all I can think of is I'd have to roll the character back up. I'd have to get us back to this point. And then we wouldn't be able to do this quest, though. That's, that's the only really big issue. So I'm going to look into this and see if there's anything we can do. Uh, if not, you know, it's not that hard just to roll the character back up to 7. My only worry is if we continue to have, like, game-breaking bugs like this, like, how much can we actually progress? So, sorry, going to be a little bit of a shorter one today. I do apologize. Not really, at this point, anything I could do about it, though. Um, I, I'm going to see if I can just maybe grind up another character. Maybe I'll try to see if I can get us past this quest. Uh, and then we'll go from there. Sorry guys, thanks for being here. I really do appreciate it and we will see you again very soon. Bye for now.